We are Robin and Kathy, and these are our adventures in our Avan Applause 500 Camperman, Serenity. Hello viewer. Well, as you can see, we're back in Serenity, and we're um, heading out on a lovely hot summer's day in early January to um, the Hunter Valley. For a day trip, check out a winery or two, uh, do a bit of filming and also we're trialling out these new Rode microphones which hopefully are going to um, improve the uh, quality of our audio recordings. in it and it's just rattles the van something terrible um, but we'll be off it soon not that I think the side roads are going to be much better well we're off the M1 and um, the road's slightly better but it wouldn't say a lot better but certainly now heading out to the, um, the Hunter Valley where we've been several times before. It's always an enjoyable day trip, even if you don't spend too many, spend too much time going to the wineries. Here we are passing through Cessnock. Cessnock is a city in the Hunter region of New South Wales and dates back to 1826. The Hunter was and still is an active coal mining area. Cessnock has transformed itself from a coal mining town to the tourist gateway to the vineyards of the Hunter Valley. And this is um, Ernest Hill Winery. Our first port of call. Been here once before, and there were kangaroos running around through the um, vineyard. So we'll have a look in a while and see if we can find any, but it might be a little bit hot for them right now. So, um, red berry notes with that one. A little bit of white pepper, kind of, it finished quite a smooth pepper, but it's, it's more fruit forward. Um, and a bit more, it, it's light to medium body for mm. here in the Hunter with a warm mm. climate area. Um, whereas down south, where it's a bit cooler, it takes longer for the grapes to ripen. So you end up with bigger Shiraz or bigger reds. Like right, like, like a fuller body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm. Um, whereas, yeah, this one we describe as more fruit forward. Fruit forward, yeah. Okay. The um, local Shiraz was very nice and we have invested in a bottle. You can see the vines and look here, you can see the grapes. Quite a ways off harvest yet, but um, that'll be the 2023 crop. We came out looking for a couple of kangaroos and there they are. It's a beautiful afternoon, or actually late morning here, and um, you can see the grapevines all laid out. We've spotted a couple of kangaroos, and it's a lovely spot. And just as promised, Cook has not only boiled the kettle, but is making some cuppers for some morning tea. Morning tea 
and it is hot. In the heart of the Hunter Valley now, and uh, amongst all the wineries, there's Oakvale, some big, some very small little family setups. But it's a very popular tourist destination. Well, we're approaching what we hope is a nice little park up for lunch, which we've found on wiki camps and this is it and it does look nice a bit of shade because it's uh, turned into a very hot afternoon so parked up for lunch and this is our view it's really nice just a little bit of elevation and we can see the valley and um, environs well, this was a nice spot to stop and have our lunch it's been very pleasant here yes we looked on wiki maps and found this so good one wiki maps yeah it's um quite amazing how through winter and spring we had so much rain yet a few warm days and everywhere has dried out so quickly here here. is cook rain. doing what she does best a little bit of navigation. Heading out now from our park up, lunch consumed, and uh, off to another winery. What's it called? Elborn. Elborn, of which we know nothing about, but I suspect we're going to learn. Here's another camper coming the other way. It could be a tight squeeze. Yeah, it could be. Anyway, I'm just getting, it goes a bit quick. Here we go. Not a problem. Our destination, Elfin. Elfin Hill, is that it? No. No, we've done it again. So we've got another 200, 200 metres to, to go. go. Pulling into Elbourne Winery. Some confusion, it's right next to another winery, but also begins with E, so that threw us for a while. We're right now. But here we are. Really nice grounds here. Very nice family feel. Tucked away in the hills of Pocolban is the Elborn Winery. It is a boutique family operated winery offering single vineyard wines which are not blended. We had a lovely afternoon of leisurely tasting and we purchased a 2021 Tempranillo and a 2021 Sagranito. Around the back, we've got this beautiful pool. What a superb outlook. Unfortunately, I think it's for the family, so we weren't invited to go and have a play. But on an afternoon like this, where it is very hot and very humid, it would have been ideal. Okay, we've just left our last winery for the day and we're heading home. It's been a lovely day. It looks like um, we've been hearing some thunder. There's a bit of a storm coming in that's from somewhere. Um, so we'll just take that as it comes. You wouldn't know it from the blue sky ahead. It's been a lovely day. It's been quite warm. It's been up around 35 degrees, but that's part of the course when you live in Australia in summer. Um, it's beautiful spot, the Hunter Valley. We're lucky we don't live far away from it. We come here three or four times a year just for day trips, bring some wine home. Happy days.